Have you ever asked, why is it windy at the beach, especially during noontime? Or can you step on the beach without slippers during daytime? Why? Hi, I'm Teacher Lei, and today we are going to tackle about the local wind systems, such as land breeze and sea breeze. For today's objective, at the end of the lesson, you should be able to differentiate land breeze and sea breeze. But before that, let us have a short review about your past lesson. What happens when air is heated? Does air rise or sink? If your answer is heated air or warm air rises, then you are good. you are right. And which heats up faster, land or sea? Did you say land? Then you are right. Land heats up fast, faster and cools down faster. Since water has a higher heat capacity, it takes a bit more time to warm up. And it's able to retain the, the heat longer than the land does. Now, let us use these two concepts you have learned to explain how land breeze and sea breeze are. As the name suggests, these two local wind systems along coastal areas or areas which adjust in large water bodies. So, take a look closely at the diagram. During daytime, when the sun is up, the land heats up very quickly, and the air above it gets warmer than the air over the water. The warm air over the land is as dense and begins to rise. Low pressure is formed above the land, while higher pressure is formed over the water. As winds, is, as winds typically blow from high to low pressure areas, then the cooler breeze then comes from sea, and it's called sea breeze. At night, the reverse happens. The loss of heat source causes land to quickly cool down, while the water retains its warmth. This means that the air over the water warmer, less dense, and begins to rise. Low pressure is created over the water, High pressure is formed. As winds typically blow from high to low pressure areas, the cooler breeze then comes from land and is called a land breeze. Did you see the difference between the two breezes? You can tell the difference between the two breezes by identifying the time. When each type of breeze occurs, and you can also differentiate the two breezes by the source of each or the place where the cold wind originates. Once more, take a look closely to the two diagrams. So now, can you tell tell the difference between the two breezes? Land breeze is formed at night, while sea breeze is formed at daytime. Land breeze comes from land, sea breeze comes from sea. Now that you have learned about the difference between the land breeze and sea breeze, let's get you more equipped by this concept by having an activity. So get your pen and paper ready as we begin this activity. Pick one flower and read the rhythm. You are given 30 seconds to answer this activity. Now, it's time to check your, your answer.
You did the great job today. I hope that you have learned so much today. I want to end my lesson to this point. Smell the sea, feel the peace, hear the ocean, be at peace. Again, I'm Teacher Leia, Joseph Webb, Grade 7 Science Teacher. Don't worry, be happy, and keep learning. Learning together even when we're apart. Thank you, and God bless you.